I'll try it one more time. I had to go check out the greenhouse because he brought in some really fabulous plants. So I thought I'd walk down here and check it out. Boy, was it hot today? It's like a million and a half degrees. I didn't think it could get any hotter. So I waited for it to cool down and the rain came. Everything looks real pretty. We're gonna go see what he's talking about. Do what you have. Ooh, very nice, very nice. Ooh, that's a string of dolphin. That is a string of dolphin and it's beautiful. Ooh. Oh, he was right. Look at string of pearls. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Oh, the string of dolphins are huge. Pretty cool. Oh, we brought in some new succulents and this is one of my favorites. I love this. I don't know what it's called. Oh, this is a senum of like a, somebody was just asking me about a good ground cover. And uh, this is one I would choose. It's a senum of some kind. I don't know. Tell me in the comments if you know for sure, please. I don't know, there's so many beautiful succulents. Ooh, that's a cute one. I don't know, I love them all. Oh, burrow tail. I'll show you when I walk over there. Oh, no, here's one. Little burrow tail for $2.50. Because all of this table is $2.50. All of that. Look at the Gasteria. How cool is that? Oh, I like it. Lovely. I'm showing the African Violets, but they're not for sale. They're for someone else. But aren't they pretty? I like this one. This is something new. This is a food forest kit. You get everything in this tray. It includes peppers, bananas. I don't know what everything is. Uh, there's vanilla. Um, I don't know. I'm going to have to get at the list and write it all down. Maybe there's potato. I don't know what that is. Anyways, food forest kit. Everything you need to build your canopy. And then all the way down to your herbaceous layer and ground cover. Even got a ground cover. Ain't that cool? Um, I have to ask Ken how much it cost for someone to buy the whole kit. Beautiful, beautiful bananas. Cool. Uh, this is the dollar seventy-five area, and uh, we have some really nice succulents in the dollar seventy-five. So uh, we got chocolate. Soldiers, Kalanchoes, we even have burrow tail for $1.75. You cannot beat that, you guys. Um, this, I, come on. What is this? Please help me, what is this? Chrysula? No, I don't know. You guys help me. What is that? Here's the succulents we have for three dollars and fifty cents. Some of them are really, really cute. Which includes burrow tail. Ooh, look at that gasteria. There we are. I love that one. Propeller plant. Ooh. Beautiful hot for you. Three fifty cactus. 
This is an amphilium that I had shown, uh, had filmed in our greenhouse that's blooming up there. I don't know if I'll be able to publish it before this video, but it will come out soon and you can see what this looks like blooming. It's fabulous. We have Madagascan palms, Arizona barrel cactuses, we have memory, I don't know, there's just all kinds. I don't even know what all these cactuses are because I'm still learning. But finger cactus is cool. Bunny ear, different colors. Um, Madagascan, um, Madagascan octillo, is that called? Madagascan octillo. Oh, it's really beautiful. I love it. We have like three different Sansevierias. I think these are called like dragon fingers. Six dollars, two dollars and fifty cents. Up to ten dollars for large ones. And look at what those look like. And you know, twenty years, maybe more. Pretty neat. and put a sign that says don't touch plants and I just want to take a second to talk about that. So I'm a plant toucher. I love touching leaves. You'll see me in these videos. I touch the leaves. Leaves are natural and they're just so beautiful, colorful, they have textures and I'm a leaf toucher. But what they say is when you touch a leaf it actually causes mental stress to the plant. So even though nothing might happen to the plant if you touch the leaf something might happen to it. It might shrivel up, it might lose it. and That's just not worth it to us because we have to sell all of these plants so that we can afford to take care of all of the crazy critters we do. So, um, you know, no touching plants until you take them home and then touch them all you want because I touch mine all the time. Like, I want to touch, I want to go and put my head right there and be like, look, my hair, it's so long. You might think I'm goofy, but come on, don't you want to do it? And then last but least on the way out, we'll talk about edibles. We have, um, of course, all the herbs, lots of selection of herbs. And uh, we have the turmeric that we grew from tissue culture. We have a loquat that was donated. We have figs, two figs. We have goose gourd, papaya, and cantaloupe for three dollars and fifty cents that we started by seed. We have um, oh, other fig trees, smaller. So figs for eight and fifteen. A beautiful genberry for twenty. Two Barbados cherries. Oh look, that fig has fruit. Cool. So two Barbados cherries for usually they're maybe 20 of that size, 25. We have a $30 Florida Bell Peach, a $30 Tropic Beauty Peach, we have $30 Florida Glow Peach is quite a few of those. One of my favorites, Joba de Cava, you know, because I can actually say it, so it's, you know, I feel special. But no, this one is so beautiful when it comes to blooming, and the fruiting goes against the bark here, and it just, it's just a very special tree, combined with the fact that it's a South American tree, and you'll find yellowfoot tortoises hanging out under this, waiting for the fruit to trip, drop, so of course we love it. And we have a white guava, and that's good size. Lemongrass, six dollars, seven dollars, seven dollars for this group here. Last times so we were selling them for six, but you never know. I mean, you have to pay for what you have to pay for. If we buy them from a different grower, it just works that way. But those are beautiful, healthy bushes for seven dollars. And then herbs, peppers with pepper plants, or pepper plants with peppers.
These are $2.50 and they already have peppers. How cool is that? Thyme, parsley, basil, parsley, basil, sweet, spinach, oregano, abaraxis, rosemary, uh, what is that? Is that cilantro? Parsley? That's parsley. It smells so good over here. It's crazy. Alright, well that's the herbs we have there. We have mint of some kind. Ooh, it smells so good. Do you guys smell it? Oh, it smells so good. Lovely. A thyme, a beautiful thyme bush. There we have this one beautiful miracle bush. And it has fruit. And it has buds galore. I mean, it's a hundred dollar bush, but uh, we hope nobody buys it so we can plant it. And then we have also, oh, a golf ruby plum for thirty dollars. That's a good one to have in the food forest land now. All right, you guys, this is Sharice from Crazy Plants Nursery, and we invite you guys to come out and support us. Tomorrow is Saturday. We're open from 10 to 3, and uh, all the proceeds that uh, um, come from plant sales tomorrow go directly to the fence project um, for the second part of the phase fence. I'll walk up, and on our way home, I'll show you exactly what we're doing so you know what you're supporting when you come out. Have a nice night, you guys. All right, so you guys, animal on well, the nursery is that way. Animal facility is that way. And what we're going to do is um, we're going to put a fence from there all the way over there. All the way over there. And then we'll be able to make sections, you know, come this way. And then all the tortoises that are in that part of the facility, which is now a lot of sand because tortoises are so heavy and they walk a lot. All of those will come to the grass, and then we can grow grass in those stalls. And it's one big plan, and we can do it with the help from you guys. So please come out tomorrow. We still like you to, you can bring your children, we invite you to bring your children. We just ask them not to touch plants, just to look at their beauty. Um, we hope you guys have a good night. Well, that's kind of stupid, isn't it? All that good night, happiness.